after the Prague and Munich editions of the conference Young Musicology, it is our pleasure to welcome you to Belgrade, to the Institute of Musicology of Serbian Academy of Sciences and Arts, this time in virtual space. During these three days we shall hear two keynotes, numerous presentations and two concerts. Also, we shall address topics related to the shaping of the present by the future, as well as the relationships of ethnomusicology and musicology with contemporaneity. The Institute of Musicology was founded in 1948 at the initiative of academician Petr Konjovic, a prominent and prolific composer, conductor, music writer, teacher, professor and rector of the Music Academy in Belgrade. The goal of the Institute's founders was to establish an institution that would organize research into the history of Serbian music and musical folklore. The Institute of Musicology is engaged in publishing activities, as well as the organization of scholarly conferences on musicology and ethnomusicology, both national and international. Since 2001, the Institute has been issuing the International Journal Musicology. Now, Dr. Jelena Jovanović, Senior Research Fellow and Correspondent Member of Serbian Academy of Sciences and Arts, as well as Dr. Ivana Medić, Senior Research Associate, will greet us with their respective addresses. In certain moments in history, we recognize that we are standing on a passage from one period to another, right as we were on the edge of one era that is passing away, and at the same time on the very beginning of the other, which we can only suspect or recognize its counters, but we are not and, and cannot be sure how much we can anticipate the real future sequence of events. In previous decades, such moments were relatively frequent in Serbia and in the Balkan region, and every time in scholar circles appeared a strong need to reconsider the present and, if possible, to predict what is forthcoming. One such moment in history is right this one, which we live in. That is why the symposium entitled Young Musicology, Belgrade 2020, Shaping the Present by the Future, Ethnomusicology and the Contemporaneity, designed and in whole organized by representatives of the youngest generation of researchers, doctoral stu students in the Institute of Musicology of the Serbian Academy of Scientist, Sciences and Arts, has been an event that is extremely interesting thematically and intellectually, and I would add also a very exciting one, in the time full of strange novelties and uncertainties. Young colleagues who gathered musicologists, ethnomusicologists and ethnochoreologists of their and to a lesser extent older generation reassess the place and role of the two disciplines in contemporary world, their methodologies, strategies and generally challenges that set up before them and before the humanities in the time of reflections in front of the future events. The program of the symposium encompasses an impressive range of subjects in domains of young colleagues' research interests, from performance aspects via music of the minorities, inter- and trans transdisciplinarity, to the questions of new technologies and media in domains of traditional, art, applied and popular music. Enthusiasm that follows their coping with questions of the new era together with their guest colleagues from nine countries, encourages and bodes that the new perspectives will open in front of them and that they will have a tool for challenges that are to come. Their courage and openness to face them do not leave any doubt in new directions of ethno-musicological thought to be developed. I cordially welcome all the guests and all participants of the symposium and I wish them fruitful and successful work. Good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Ivana Medic. I'm a senior research associate of the Institute of Musicology of the Serbian Academy of Sciences and Arts. And on behalf of my director, Katarina Tomasevic, and everybody else in the Institute, it is my very great pleasure and great honor to welcome you all to this conference, um, Young Musicology. 
this conference is actually um, the third part of the franchise that was initiated several years ago um, in this Central European space. So the first edition of the eponymous conference was held in Prague. Uh, then the next one was two years ago in Munich, in Germany. And then our colleagues from Belgrade volunteered to organize the third edition of the conference. And uh, another reason why we are so proud, because this is the first time that our young colleagues from the Institute of Musicology have um, organized the conference completely independently. Uh, we were lucky to um, employ eight young colleagues, students of um, doctoral studies, uh, from 2017 to 2019, plus one young librarian. So we have nine young people in the Institute, which is fantastic for the working atmosphere, for the new energy that they have brought to the Institute, new topics for research, new attitudes to the existing uh, literature. Uh, and so we were very happy to um, allow them to conceive this conference the way they thought it should be done. So without any external interference from the older colleagues, it was really their idea and their realization. So in that sense, I think uh, the pressure is on them, but also the joy of an accomplishment. Um, the conference is planned to last for three days. Uh, there will be 17 papers, two keynote lectures, um, one uh, book launch, during as a side event and also there will be two concerts. Due to these unfortunate COVID pandemics, um, some people who were planned to come to Belgrade unfortunately could not make it, so they pre-recorded their lectures and sent them to us, including one of the keynote speakers, Professor David Beard from the Cardiff University in the United Kingdom. And also some of these um, participants from abroad have also pre-recorded their uh, papers and talks. Uh, all discussions will be done live. They will be moderated from this place right here in this room. And um, you will whoever is interested uh, will receive a Zoom link so they will be able to uh, participate in the discussions after each panel of the conference. The entire program of the conference has also been published on the uh, official Facebook page of the Institute of Musicology of the Serbian Academy of Sciences and Arts, so you're very welcome to download it if you want to. Uh, two concerts organized within the conference are devoted to two different types of music. One of them is a concert of traditional music, while the second one uh, showcases the works of some of the most um, important modernist composers from the 20th century here in Serbia. Uh, Josip Slavensky, Vlastimir Pericic and Ljubica Maric. So, um, whichever you prefer, or you can listen to them both. Um, both concerts, as well as keynote lectures by Professor David Beard and Professor Selena Rakočević from the Faculty of Music in Belgrade. Um, they will be uh, also uploaded on YouTube, so you can uh, listen to them in your own free time, whenever you decide. I would also like to thank our colleagues from other institutions because all of our young uh, researchers are, are also PhD students at different institutions. So many of them are students at the Faculty of Music in Belgrade, at the departments of Musicology and Ethnomusicology. One colleague is a PhD student at the Department of History of the Faculty of Philosophy, University of Belgrade and another one is a student at the Faculty of Media and Communication of the University Singidunum in Belgrade. So we have quite a diverse uh, range of disciplines here, although it is called the Musicology Institute. Actually, it's not just about historical musicology, but actually we explore many different musics and apply a range of theoretical approaches. And I think all the papers on the program will showcase this diversity of our disciplines today. Um, so, welcome to the conference.